the meditation tonight is really some sort of a the second letter is gratitude a gratitude letter so let's do this meditation a gratitude meditation so start to relax Just breathe in very easily and comfortably, and then breathe out. Whatever it is that is on your mind, start to let go. Allow the thoughts, if any thoughts should come up, allow it to come up and allow it to leave just as easily. Don't try to chase it. Don't try to second guess it. Don't try to create a dialogue with those thoughts. A thought came up, wonderful. Allow it to leave just as easily. And just focus on your own breathing and pay attention to relaxing your body. Give your mind something else to do. Allow it to just focus on breathing in and breathing out. And start to imagine that you're at the top of a building. This building is your body. And imagine that you are getting into the elevator and from your head, being the top of the building. Just put the intention that you want to travel to where your heart is. So press the button that has a heart in it in the elevator. Allow the elevator doors to close and then feel your attention moving down from your head down to your nose, your mouth, your chin, your neck, your shoulders, your chest, and all the way down to your heart. As the door opens, you step out and go slightly to the left and enter the chamber of your heart. And just be there. Just have an experience of your heart. Feel it. And as you are in your heart, feeling the each beating of your heart, start to recount your day. Think back at the first moment this morning when you open your eyes, be grateful that you have eyes, that you can see the beautiful sunshine this morning. 
Oh, what a beautiful snow this morning. What a beautiful rain this morning. Whatever the morning may have looked like. Just feel and let it be okay to be grateful that you woke up this morning and you breathe into the day. Be grateful for your body. Body, body, body. Thank you so much for allowing me to experience this world, my creation. Thank you, body. Thank you for my hands. Thank you for my fingers. Thank you for all my limbs. Thank you for each eye that I have. Thank you for each strand of hair that I have. Thank you for each pore on my skin. Thank you for each cell in my body. It's a miracle that they all work together to create this experience to allow me to experience this moment thank you for everyone that i get to see today Thank you. No matter what our exchange, how our lives has crossed path, be they nice or not so nice, it is an experience. Thank you. Each and every person that I have talked to have looked upon or have touched somehow throughout the day. Thank you for all the other versions of me that I manage to interact with this day. Some of them may have been despicable. Some of them may have been infinitely kind to me. And I am grateful for all experiences with each and every aspect of me. Thank you for all the other aspects of me that I didn't get to interact today, that I didn't get to talk to you. But they are doing their best in their lives. And all of the actions in orchestration with each other is what makes this world the way it is. Thank you for all the other aspects of myself that's preparing for what 
for voting in the UK. Thank you for all the other aspects of myself that is going through turmoil in Hong Kong. Thank you for all the other aspects of myself that is going through different parts of the world. All the other aspects of me that is living out what it is that is meaningful for themselves. All seven plus billions. Living on so many different levels of consciousness. Thank you for everything that I have in my life. Thank you for the roof of my head. Thank you for the food on my table. Thank you for the clothes that kept me warm today. Thank you for the books that enriched my mind. Thank you for all the humorous videos that my friends posted on Facebook. Thank you for all the meditations that's available on YouTube. in audio form. Thank you for all those wonderful creations that help make it possible and easy for myself. To be able to shift my mind when I needed it. Thank you for the guidance of my soul, of my higher self, of my spirit guides. You know, it may not be easy sometimes trying to wake up someone with a skull as thick as mine. Thank you. For my mother and for my father. Thank you for my siblings. Thank you for each and every one of my family. Even though sometimes I may believe that their own, their very existence is really to torment me. But I know that they are a gift. Each one of them has enriched my life, has enriched my human experience, have helped carry me or push me 
into exactly the direction that I needed to go. In order to be me at this moment in time. Thank you for my kids. Thank you for my daughter or daughters, my son or my sons. Thank you for each and every one of them. But they have taught me something about love. They have taught me the big lessons, whether they be my family or my enemies or my frenemies. Everyone in my life has somehow contributed to my understanding of what love is. Because each and every one of them, whether they are my family or not, they are different aspects of me. How I feel about them is truly a reflection of how I feel about myself. I am grateful for all interactions. Of myself. Thank you for the universe for giving me all that I have. I hold everything in my heart right now and allow this gratitude to expand so that it is as big as my whole body and as big as the whole building as big as the whole country, as big as all of Earth, and as big as all of the galaxy, and as big as all of existence. I am grateful for this experience of life that is a miracle. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs>